The government of Ekiti State says it is advancing with sensitization of the people ahead of the arrival of COVID-19 vaccines. The state had in January taken delivery of over 200 solar-powered vaccine storage equipment. Meanwhile, the state government has directed workers on grade levels 2 to 12 to resume on Monday. They have been working from home since January in the wake of the second wave of COVID-19. But with vaccination in view, the government believes the full workforce can resume, but with complete compliance with all COVID-19 protocols. We currently have uh, jingles going out. We have uh, conversations with our religious institutions and our traditional leaders to further encourage our people to come out. So from a demand generation point of view, the state continues to push out what is important. Besides that, we're working very closely with the federal government. There is, um, we started with commenced training of our healthcare workers. Just yesterday, we did a sensitization of the rapid response team that we have in the state. An important question is, are people around here favorably disposed to taking the vaccines? A lot of people are ignorant. They don't know or they can't see the advantages of that uh, vaccine, but I think uh, the advantages is more than the disadvantages. So I will encourage you to take it. Personally, if I have a do it, I will take it too. In our uh, environment here, we are somehow skeptical in taking things like that. Like when you sell people to, uh, their children to come for vaccination, some, some of our parents will say, don't go, you know, that could kill, but actually it's not killing. What it's meant for is to give the live attenuated organism that boosts the immune system of the child. The awareness and sensitization will continue and compliance is still expected on the part of the people. Babajide Agbeo for COVID-19 update.